The family of Jonathan Villarreal wants to know why the man who shot him at a house in the South Overton neighborhood last week has not been arrested. KMAX Cameron Mendoza spoke with them this afternoon, and Cameron, they had a lot to say about the police investigation. Yeah, Brian and Lauren, Jonathan's family is heartbroken over his loss and to make matters more difficult, they don't understand why the man who shot their brother and nephew was not arrested. Tonight, they tell me the two things they want, answers and justice. I just don't, I just don't want this to be swept under the rug and just get forgotten. A week after 28-year-old Jonathan Villarreal was shot and killed near 15th and Avenue U, his family pleading with police for more information and justice. He just told me that my brother was gone. I fell out, I lost it, and whoever did it, like, I'm, I'm learning to forgive that person, but right now it's hard to forgive him because he took my happiness, he took my happiness from not just me, but from his daughter, from my family. According to the police report, 43-year-old Christopher Carter was working with a customer at this property. When Villarreal showed up and the two had gotten in an argument. Police saying Villarreal had shown a gun, prompting Carter to shoot. He could have just warned him or walked him off the property. You know, he could have done something different. Jonathan's family says now they are uncertain of what's to come with this investigation and feel like they're left out of the loop. And they say although Jonathan had had a rough past and wasn't perfect, he leaves behind a family that's just wanting answers. I just want everybody to remember Jonathan as a good person. Yeah, I see it like as, as he was murdered to me, not self-defense. And I hope that my sister gets justice for her son. Now, PD telling us that this special crimes unit is continuing to investigate this case. Anyone with new or additional information is asked to call Crime Line at 806-741-1000.